Donna Emery from Glover Nursery in West Jordan, Utah, and I'm planting a hydrangea. This is an ice crystal oak leaf hydrangea, a very cold hardy variety. And we're choosing to plant this in the fall. If I were planting a mop head hydrangea or one of the more tender ones, I'd opt for a spring planting if I could, or at least an early fall planting to allow it to become established before the cold weather hits. But anytime the ground's not frozen, you can plant most hardy plants. This soil has already been amended with a good organic compost, so I don't need to add any more to it. And anybody who's ever gardened in Utah will know already that I've amended this soil previously, because normally Utah soil doesn't look this good. Loosening the sides. I want my hole to be about twice the diameter of the pot. Don't dig a deep hole. You don't want to plant the plant too deep. I'm gonna get some good starter fertilizer. Put a handful of it in and around that hole. Sprinkle some over here. If you're planting in the fall, you'll want to use less fertilizer. You want to re promote root growth, but not shoot growth, just in time for cold weather. And this plant has a few funny branches, so I'm gonna get rid of those. That one's not necessary. Let's see how the rest of it does. Oh, the rest of it looks okay. I'm going to turn the plant on its side and support it while I pull the plant pot off. Check for depth. It's a little bit deep. Okay. Most sides have, most plants have a good side and a bad side. So I think I'll find the best side. And start back filling. Tamp the soil lightly. Don't overly compact it, but firm it around the roots. Then I'm checking to make sure I don't have any soil on top of that original root ball. I want to be able to see those roots when I'm finished. Or just a light dusting of soil. What it needs now is a good thorough watering followed by a second watering about an hour later. And before I leave, I'm going to take any tags or string off of this plant. I don't want to risk girdling the plant. So off comes the identification tag. I can make a plant label for it if I need to know what variety it is. Here's our hydrangea, great for fall planting or spring planting. I'm Donna Emery from Glover Nursery.